Okay, these visuals, because we are shifting track right now to a different story, one that we learnt about a few hours ago that took place right here in Delhi's Dwarka. A security guard was beaten up brutally by a drunk man. This was in the Dwarka region. Now, Delhi police say that the guard was beaten. The perpetrator's name was Sahil, and this was over, reportedly, a parking issue. Now, the guard sustained an injury over his left eyebrow. The statement of the guard has been taken and registered. A medical examination of the perpetrator was conducted. It was found, as we told you, that he was under the influence of alcohol. Now, you can see the security guard in this picture. Uh, it isn't too clear who the other people are. We'll go over to a reporter to get more context. Anshul, uh, my colleague is with us right now to bring us more context. Anshul, uh, you are joining us on the left side of our screens. On the right side, we're actually playing out this video for our audiences. So though you can't see it right now, I'm sure you've already seen it. Can you just tell our audiences who are the other people in that video? Uh, is the perpetrator, the alleged drunk man who beat up the guard, is he also in that video? Uh, so yes, that uh, person is also in that video and the people that you are seeing arguing are the family members of that person. Uh, because remember, the person was actually under the influence of the alcohol when he went ahead and smashed the head uh, of the guard uh, with, a, uh, with a stick is what we are being told. And he had some uh, injuries, uh, some injuries over, over his left eyebrow and he was admitted to the hospital. Now, when the other members of the society went to confront uh, that person at his residence, at his house, his family members come out, came out supporting him and started arguing with the people who had, who had re uh, reached his residence. So this actually tells the high, uh, high headedness of the people who are living uh, in, in that society. In fact, the family members of the, of the accused and how they think that the people who are working uh, under them, uh, who are actually making sure that this society is safeguarded, uh, they can be assaulted, they can be attacked, and the manner in which the person uh, is being protected by the family members also tells an, uh, also tells an entire story of how uh, the uh, entire family was actually high-headed and eventually went on to say that the guard was actually uh, arguing with them and started using curse, uh, curse words. That is the reason why uh, they went ahead and assaulted him. But yes, on the other hand, when the medical examination of the accused was done, he was found under the influence of the alcohol, whereas the medical examination of the victim has also been done. Uh, now, since the quantum of punishment is under seven years, the accused has not been arrested. But yes, he has been bound down by the Dwarka police, which means that he cannot leave his residence without the permission of the Delhi police. And over the next few hours, we are expecting that the accused will be presented in front of, front of the court where the uh, quantum of, uh, where the uh, uh, arguments would happen if if at all he ne needs to be sent to a judicial custody or some some sort of fine could be imposed so against him the uh, because the nature of injury is not grievous is not grievous and hence uh, the quantum of punishment in this entire matter is less than seven years and hence the arrest has not been made but yes the police has bound him down and over the next few hours we can expect uh, more action to be taken and in, when the uh, accused is finally presented in front of the court it remains to be seen will the court impose some sort of fine or compensation uh, on the accused or will the court uh, deem it necessary to send him uh, to judicial custody as a punishment uh, in this entire matter. All right, Anshul, thank you for bringing us that context. We're continuing to play out those visuals. As we told you, those visuals are coming in from the northwestern part of Delhi, Dwarka. All right, we're going to move on from this story now to a different story. We're receiving breaking news.